Okay, so you're in Microsoft Word and you want to put an image inside text. Now, unfortunately, Word doesn't provide a button or a function that enables you to do this, but there is a very easy workaround. What you should do is click where you want the text to appear, then go to the Insert tab on the ribbon and use this Smart Art button. Make sure all is selected down the side here, and then make sure this basic block list is selected. Click on OK. Now we've got five boxes here, but we only need one. So press delete four times. Don't worry about the blue background. We'll get rid of that eventually. Now click into the box and type your text. So to format that text, select it. And then I can go to the Home tab, change the font. And I could increase the size. Next, go to the Format tab on the ribbon. You can see an option here called Text Fill. If you click on that, you can go down to Picture. And then you need to decide where you're going to get your image from. So I've got something on my laptop. So I'm going to select From a File. And I'm going to select this image here. So you can see the image in the background of the text. Now to get rid of this blue background, you need to go to the Format tab on the ribbon and over to the Shape Fill option and then select No Fill. Now to get rid of this white space above and below the text, you can change the size of this container. And I can do that by dragging this white circle up. But you can see the text ends up on two lines. Now to resolve that, just click somewhere near the text and you'll see a separate box, which you can then widen. So I can continue to do that until I lose all the white space. Now, if you click outside that text, you can see that that container is no longer visible. Now, I'll show you a few options in terms of positioning this image within the text. So I'll select the text, right click, and go to Format Shape. And I need to make sure on the right hand side of the screen here that I have this text options selected. And you can see down here that we have options for tiling the picture. So I'm going to tick that. And then I can change the position of the image within the text. So for example, if I change the offset X value, that moves the image left or right behind my text. If I change the offset Y value, that moves the image up and down within the text. You can also change the size of the image within the text. At the moment, this is set at 20%, but I could increase it or decrease it. And you can see that the size of the image is changing within the text. Now, the other thing you can do is you can have different images behind different text. So for example, I'm going to change this text to warm. And, and then I'm going to have cold. Now, what I want is a different image behind the word cold. So I'm going to select that text and then click on this Insert button, and I'm going to select a different image. Let's select this image here of these hoarfrost trees. And that's quite a nice effect. OK, that's all I wanted to cover in this particular video. Hopefully that's useful. If it is, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe, and I'll see you next video.